can I just shoot him? We're trying to help you, I want to shoot him. Hello there, watchy people. How is it going? Welcome back to LA Noir with me, Kane83, and Mr. Cole Phelps here. We've been uh, looking around this place. I think we've picked up all of the evidence. Um, but maybe we'll just have a bit more of a wander around just to make sure. Um, I don't think there's anything, anything more to look at around here. This is all just scenery and stuff. Um, and I don't think we're supposed to look around in the shop anymore. Uh, I think we're supposed to just get on with interviewing the guy now. So let's let's check that that's the case. Let's go and talk to uh, Bukowski. Oh, apparently we're going straight straight on. Okay. You ever do any work for Mark Bishop? Mainly do work for the studios. RKO, Republic, Warner Brothers. So yeah. When Bishop is doing work for a studio, yes. When did you last see him? Yeah, I'm doing work for his next picture. Still pre-production though. I haven't seen him around here in a while. Yeah, that doesn't sound right. Okay, uh, victim's drug, underwear, letter from mother, prop shrunken head, evidence of abuse, prop store photograph, movie set photograph, movie set replica, hang on, prop store photograph, Bishop and Hopgood. Uh, can we say, can we use that to say? Okay, saddle, $20,000 check. Blackmail, yeah. Oh, evidence. Mark Bishop to suppress for scan. Okay, chlorohydrate film reel. Bishop's whereabouts. Empty film canister. Prop shrunken head. Okay. So I think we're going to say lie. I know you're lying, Hopgood. Bishop was here, and you know exactly what he was doing and what he left lying around afterwards. You come in here without a warrant, and now you start throwing your weight around? Uh, so, movie set photograph, so it's going to be the f that film reel. Yes, there we go. How she was drugged and molested at a casting house. I found the no, coral no, hydrate in your drinks cabinet. You give me she didn't remember anything. Your fucking jaw hop good. Bishop was here with June Ballard and the girl. A, a lot of producers and directors use this place. I I'm not responsible for what goes on here. Yeah, um, kind of are. McAfee's men are looking for Bishop. We need to find him first. Any idea where he might have gone to ground? If he really tried to kill McAfee's wife, my advice to him would be to leave town. Yeah, that's probably, probably true. Okay, I'm going with the intuition again, guys. We're going to use it all up <laughs> on this. Uh, okay, they said that's the truth. You're delivering props to Jungle Drums on 8th Street? Bishop is using that old rundown wreck of a set. That place is dangerous. Okay. But it might be a good spot to hide. Relationship with Ballard. What's the deal with you and June Ballard? Look, buddy, I make props. I hardly ever meet the talent unless it's something tailor-made for them, like a sword or something. Okay, let's check the notebook again. Um, evidence of abuse, prop store photograph, movie set photograph, movie set replica saddle. So that's made out to Lorna Hopgood. The account of Mark Bishop. Um... Interesting. Okay, so blackmail. What should bring to suppress scandals? I don't know what's the thing here. Uh, I don't think we've got any evidence for this. Uh, okay, we're doing it. We're using the intuition. 
lie. Okay, so we need to find. You and Ballard are blackmailing Bishop. Ah, That's why he okay. You got nothing on me. My hands are clean on this. Okay. Underwear. Nope, not that. Not that. Not that. Prop store photograph. Movie set photograph. So replica saddle. Uh, twenty thousand dollar check made out to Lorna Hopgood. Okay. Ah, oh, that's the wrong one. Blast that's all for it. now, Hopgood. We're taking you in. Phelps. Roy Earl, advice. Hold on a moment. This is clearly a vice case. You've been roughing up my informant. Hopgood is a vice informer? Yes, he is, Phelps, and a very important one. Look at that mug. Have you been upsetting these two officers, Marlin? So we just drop it? You do if you know what's good for you. You need to catch the movie producer before an angry husband does, from what I'm hearing. I'll be making a full report to the captain, detective. You do that, kid. We're all very impressed with you. Let it slide, Cole. Let's get out of here. Huh. Detectives, Johnny Goldberg, you work for Mickey C. That's right, detectives. You wouldn't happen to know the guys who roughed up Mrs. Bishop earlier today by any chance. No, no, not us. We don't do that kind of thing. It's the <laughs> husband we'd like to talk to. This is a police matter. You don't want to be taken in for obstruction of justice, do you boys? You could try the obstruction rap, but uh, it won't stick. Yeah, we probably can. true. You've had your ten cents worth, gentlemen. Bishop knows how the world works. Mrs. McAfee hits him up for a movie part. Happens every day. But Bishop takes it a step too far and tries to rub out Mrs. McAfee. Naturally, Guy is going to get upset. What made you think Bishop would be here? We figure he might be planning a little accident for Hopgood, too. Those two guys have got some unfinished business. Really? You let us know if you find Bishop. Guy McAfee can be a very generous man. I'm only going to warn you once, gentlemen, to stay out of this. This is a police matter. We will be bringing Mark Bishop into custody. <laughs> At least he's polite. Kind of dumb, but polite. But I'm <laughs> a lot less polite, you smug son of a bitch. So let me put it in ruder terms that even a pair of blockheads like you might understand. The only reason that you don't have bars on your windows already is because you're small fry. And we don't waste our time on small fry. You stay away from Bishop, and you stay away from me. Is that clear enough for you, asshole? Now run along back to your boss so we can pat you on the head and tell you what good boys you are. Oh, that was a pleasant encounter. Nice, nice chatting to you fellas. See you later. Whoa! Going up there. Oof! He fell a long way. Man, that was a bit of a shootout. <laughs> Let's see him chase us now. Onto the movie set, Phelps. Let's roll. So our car still work. <laughs> well, that was a bit of excitement on the journey there. Oh, right. Christ. And they say working traffic is like watching paint dry. <sighs> you know how to piss people off, Bukowski. <laughs> hey, if they're prepared to gun down cops in broad daylight, McCaffrey really means business. Seems like we're the only one. Oh. Look out! The license should be removed. Yeah, let's get ourselves over to that movie Seems set. Seems like we're the only ones who want Bishop alive. I have a good mind just to let him go work on the son of a bitch. I'm about done putting my life on the line to protect some child molester. That's our job, unfortunately. They don't get to dole out the justice. Yeah, I think we could have a go at doling out some justice. We'd be pretty good at it. Here we go, just around the corner. 
This should be uh, quite good fun, hopefully. Jungle drum set, 5.30 p.m. Wow, it's a pretty cool set. Nice sniping position there. There's a slippery bastard now. No. God damn it! Get him, Phelps. <laughs> I'll cover the exit. Yeah, nobody would ever think to look for you uh, on the set of your own film. Come on, Bukowski, you should just follow him like I am. Come on, come on, come on. I just need to get close enough to do a, a tackle. No, come on. Can't I just shoot him? I want to shoot him. Yeah, well, you were the one who uh, made that mistake, my friend. Wow, this is um, this is high. <laughs> this is a long way up. Slightly concerned about this. Where's he going? Oh, he's jumping now. My goodness. I didn't do anything. Yeah, you did. Oh my goodness. This place is falling down around us. Oh, come on. You, oh, don't kick us. Why do they always kick? Man. Where do you think you're going anyway? It's a dead end, dude. Where, where did he go? Oh, he went around that way. <laughs> come on, man. We're going to get you. You know we're going to get you. Oh, it's all falling down. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Huh. Huh. We're going to get you. Come on. Stop running, man. Oh. How much more of this is going to collapse? We're never going to get back down again now. We got gotcha. you. Bishop, you're under arrest for the attempted murder of June Ballard and the rape and attempted murder of Jessica Hamilton. All right, I'll come quietly. Just don't kill me. Somebody else is going to do you that. You found me, then McAvee's goon will too. Oh, we need we need to get out of here. Oh dear. All right, but you stay close. Any tricks, and I'll save McAvee's boys the trouble. Follow me. I know another way out of this place. Okay. We are going Christ down. Detectives are trying to kill me. Well, yeah. Last to You're surprised at this? Down. Come on, get down there. It's this way. Wow, these controls. I'm still getting used to them a little bit. You hear me? You killed him for God's sake! I don't want to die. Now. Oof. Come on, stand up. We'll get him in the head this time. There we go. Shoot the barrels to destroy the wall. There's no way out of here. I thought you said you knew where you were going. We have to jump for it. Right, okay, that sounds good. Oh. Man. Find some cover. God, they're everywhere. Where's that coming from? Let's see where it's coming from. Ah, there's one. Okay, let's leg it over that way then. My goodness. Oh man. Come on, get yourself around. How did that not get in? Oh, there's one up there. He's down. Awesome, right? This is 
worse than a war zone. Uh, pretty much is a war zone right now. Damn. Out of range. Where are we supposed to go then? Can we go around the back of here? Is that going to take us down? Ah, can we use the rifle at this range? We can. Excellent. Come on. Won't let me aim. Where, where'd he go? Oh, he's over that way. It's down. What statue? What statue? Where? Um, I'm not seeing the ladder. Oh, is that it there? Okay, we got it. We slide all the way down. Right, we seem to have killed all the bad guys anyway. Get them over here! I'll cover you. Come on, the cavalry's here. Thank goodness for that. Come on, let's keep moving. Oh, they're they're not all dead yet. Get behind the, the elephant column. Shoot them quickly. What elephant column? Stay down. What barrels? What are you talking about? Oh, up there. Hey. Awesome. Well, that's a bit dramatic. Somebody's going to get a splinter in that. We need to get him to the car. You've lost your hat, but oh, we both lost our hats, Bukowski. Stay in cover. That's not good. All right, you're gone. One more. There he is. This one's got. Got ya. Right, yeah, I'm. I'm inclined to agree with you there. Let's get ourselves the heck out of here. He's shooting at us. Whoa, I shot his hat off. That was nice. Got him in the foot. There we go. All down. Whoa, that was stressful. <laughs> now this is what I call a result. Mark Bishop, erstwhile film producer, an all-around piece of shit, catches a fast ticket to Quentin for statue rape and attempted murder. So he gets to spend the next 15 years playing sissy instead of sticking it to little girls. That is justice with a capital J, Detective Phelps. You've developed such a reputation, I'm not going to be able to hold on to you any longer. You're getting promoted. Woo! Go on, get your new assignment. I'm going to need a new Good suit. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got the job, not you, Bukowski. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of cleaning up to do. Oh, 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 hello. Phelps, Bukowski, this your work? Can I help you, detective? Sorry, Cap. Didn't see you there. Yeah, I'll bet you did. This is a traffic case. You need something? I'm here to buy a drink for the two LAPD traffic cops who broke the back of Guy McAfee's private army. You don't have a problem with that, do you, Captain? Go right ahead. <laughs> Get in. I'm buying. Okay, then. Let's go for a drink. Jazz Cole, the hopheads love it. Sure, I guess. 
Big bands and swing, I can understand, but this bebop palaver? How are you supposed to dance to that? This is Phelps, Leroy. Be nice to him. You'll like this place. They treat you right. You like a table, Leroy? What do you think we want to do? Stand at the bar like I'll chumps? I'll a table ready for you. Don't look so happy to see me, Alphonse. I might get the wrong impression. Cole, this is Alphonse. He's a French Negro from Africa. Can you beat that? The Congo. A pleasure to meet you, Alphonse. Is Elsa singing tonight? Yes, she is. She has the next set. Come on, Cole. You can meet Elsa while they're fixing us a table. You'll like her. She's something else. Maybe another night, Roy. She's pretty beat up about it. Get your hands off me. Don't ever tell me what to do or what not to do, Alphonse. You got a nice club here. Don't spoil it. If you will follow me, detectives. Just through the door. It was my only real friend, Harlan. We went through it all. Do you realize what he meant to me? Of course I do. You have no idea. You said it was construction work. It was an industrial accident, Elsa. How can I be held responsible? Elsa, are you going on? Louis, for God's sake, he was my best friend. The only man who ever loved me without putting his hands on me. Hi, Elsa. Here's someone I'd like you to meet. Cole Phelps, war hero and crime fighter extraordinaire. And why would I want to meet another fascist from the LAPD? Sorry about this, Cole. What an evening I'm having. First a Negro puts his hands on me, and then this. Who do you think you're talking to, you German junkie whore? Don't you ever forget your place with me again. Do you hear me? Evening, Doc. How's business? Sanguine. Louis, help me here. I'm gonna have to give her something before her performance. Blow it off, Cole. These artsy-fartsy types always get a little flighty. Meet Dr. Harlan Fontaine, doctor to the stars. Mr. Fix-It to the mental wreckage of Hollywood. So what about that drink, boys? So a new partner looks like a nice chap. 